How to install Above ETT and to create a campaign in D&D Beyond. The first step is to Google Above ETT, then you go to the Chrome store. From here, you just click Add to Chrome, Add Extension, and it should appear here, grayed out. Once it's on a D&D Beyond campaign page, it will turn red. You can also choose to click it and pin it like that, so it stays up there. Next step is to go to D&D Beyond. In D&D Beyond, you need to sign in. You need to have an account. We're not going to go through that. Next step is to go to your campaigns, collections, campaigns. In here, you can create a campaign. I'm going to call it something. And create. Once that's done, you just go to the campaign, view campaign. And in here, you should see two buttons from above VTT. Once you have here, you have this link. You send that link to your players. They just open it, send that in, and that should bring them to this screen. Here, they can either create a character using your shared content. So for example, if you own some books in D&D Beyond, they will be able to use that. Or they can just use one of their pre-made characters. In my case, I will use Tornus. Once they join, they are a part of the campaign, and they can join from the campaign page by clicking the Join Above ETT. There is a video also for players. From this page, all you need to do as a DM is join as a DM. Get rid of the splash screen by clicking anywhere on it. And there you go, you have your first scene, it's a tavern. And here, in the Player tab, you will be able to see your players. The Player tab works by automatically inserting the data from the character, but the character sheet is not loaded because the player is not online at the moment. In this case, I will emulate the character coming in by copying this link and joining as the player. Once I've done that, this is the player view. And you shall see that in my campaign, it has loaded now all my stats, my passive perception, my movement, if I have inspiration, my HP, my AC, and some of my basic stats. It's important to note that the game log only works once you have at least one character in there. You can see the video about the game log in our playlist as well. Happy gaming!